Hey guys, it's Molly, back for another experiment. This time I wanna use aquas and beautiful colors to do a rect ring bloom. And I wanted to do, to test out really, just Amsterdam white and water as the cell activator. So I'm really hoping that the lines stick in this one and that the colors just blend to something delicious. So let's paint. All right, guys, you have requested um, that I do this um, rect ring bloom again, but this time to do um, one big bloom in the center and leave the outside edges. So that is what I'm gonna try. So this is my pouring medium in the middle. Ooh, I love these colors together. There we go, there's like my yellow. I tried to separate the yellow and the blue as much as possible because I really didn't want green out of this. Let me just move the paint around a little bit, stretch it out just a little bit. Okay, that looks very, very pretty. So I'm just gonna wreck just a little bit of it. Most of this will come off anyway. Okay, good enough. Now, I really always love the center, but you guys asked me to wreck it in the middle, so that's what I'm gonna do. So I'm just gonna start with a little bit of white, and what I'm doing, instead of puddling all the white around, I'm actually, because it will spread out a little bit, I'm just pouring it around to make the circle. This is actually just paint, Amsterdam paint and water, and I left it thick in the middle. So give me just a couple more ringlets around, and we'll see what effect we can get out of the center. Okay, my head will be in, a, in the way in a second. All right, so I'm just gonna blow on out now. I don't wanna muddy things too much because I've already got some brown happening here from blowing over the colors. I actually really like that little center that's there. I, I got a lot of brown here, you guys. There we go, there's my colors in the center. I feel like maybe I want just a little bit more of a bloom like right there. You can do this if you so I'm just gonna blow that little spot right there out some more. And then right here. And I don't know, cause I, I really like that section over there. All right, so I'm gonna tilt this out and see what happens. Let me see if my center is moving. Yes, it is, good. So I'm just gonna take this off the edge and get to the bloom section and then stretch that part back out. Trying to keep you guys in camera. Ugh, I just always love the combination of blue and orange together. So when I blew across the colors, I for sure got too much. I didn't blow correctly and I ended up with this brown color from the orange. But I'm 
on the whole, I think it's pretty cool. So when I do this again, I may try it with the regular flow trawl. I mean, with the Australian flow trawl and see. I'm, I'm really liking some of the effects in here. Like this lacing on this outer portion, that is gorgeous. So yeah, I may just have to play around with this a little bit more. I wonder what my blow, taking my blow dryer to it would do, like lightly over the top. I may try that next. All right, you guys, let me take you down. It looks really pretty from this. You guys have got a better angle than I do of it because it looks really muddy to me, but that looks just kind of like a burnt umber color that's in there. So I don't know. Again, I'm just experimenting. I have not perfected this. You know, this is something that I'm just playing with, working on. I will get it eventually, something that I'm super duper proud of. But I am not hating this, I will say, right now. So let me take you down. Yeah, I really honestly don't mind that. Maybe I'm, I don't know. I don't mind that brown color. Those stretched out cells are really pretty. Those underneath there. That right there and this right up there oh my gosh that is my favorite very very cool yeah you guys let me know what you think of this i the, this is that brown color that i'm talking about but honestly with the orange i don't know maybe i'm just being crazy but it really i do not mind it i kind of like it all right, you guys, I'll show you how it dries. All right, guys, here this is. I am so happy. Oh, I love this part right here. I, I'm so pleased with this. I can't even begin to tell you. And look, all the lacing stuck. Just paint and water dried exactly the same. Love that part right there. And no real, no cracking. This part right here, I don't even know if you can. It's like just the tiniest bit raised because the paint was just a little bit thicker. But not at all, no cracking. Love, love, love it. You guys let me know. Oh, one of my favorites. <laughs> all right, thank you guys for watching. Yep, the painting. Bye.